Is it fake? Is Shane Dawson series fake? And is Jake Paul in on this? Alright, how is everyone? You're probably thinking, why am I just sat here drinking a tea? Well, that is what I do. If you don't like it, then you can like the video. <laughs> that makes no sense. Hello, Earthlings. Oh, I'm, just, I'm, I'm just not good at intros. I'm just not good at intros. Today's video is about Shane Dawson series. For those of you who know what I'm talking about, you, you know what I'm talking about. For those of you who do... <coughs> oh my god. <coughs> That just came out of nowhere. <laughs> For those of you who don't know what I'm talking about, Shane Dawson is a YouTuber, a big one. He's got like 17 million subscribers now, which is insane. And each video he gets nowadays gets fucking millions. He gets 17, nearly 20 million each video. He's done a, a series on Jake Paul that he's, he's still carrying on now. And I think it's going to be an eight-parter. And it's the idea of YouTubers and Jake Paul being a sociopath, as they say. And... I've got to admit, man. As much as I hate Jake Paul, like, I actually hate him with a passion. He's up. I don't. He's not. He's not a sociopath. I don't think that many people on YouTube is an, an actual sociopath because they wouldn't be stable enough to even do the things they're doing. I I do agree with Logan's point though. You can have a sociopathic spectrum where you lie high or low on. Is there's a sociopathic spectrum? That 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 obviously makes sense because it's like. You are, you're not something, you're not calling someone you are opposed to sociopath, you are. Because you can't just say that about someone. Because it's, it's not something that you're diagnosed with, like, psychopath. So that's where they get the mixture comes in. Like Logan says, he's getting mixed in with sociopath and psychopath. There's going to be two definitions on the screen now. The main point is that the difference between the definitions is that, the main difference is that a psychopath is actually a disorder. You're born with that and you can't help but do that. Whereas a sociopath is a manipulator, you're choosing to do that. And that, that could that could be, again, for, because I've looked into videos and read about it, that could be different reasons like your upbringing, like traumatic events and stuff like that. I can't help but feel like Shane Dawson, yeah, you are a little bit of a sociopath. You are sociopathic, the actions you have. Uh, which actually makes sense because you're saying that Jake Paul will make a sorry video and put sad music. But then you literally just done that, you dumb person. Don't even f***ing say that. I'm sorry, but how the f*** can you say that someone's done that when you've just done it? You've exposed yourself, but you're trying to flip it round. So actually, you're the manipulator, and you are the sociopath to say. <sighs> I also feel like I'm not too sure. I'm not 100% on all the reactions. You know, the, you know, the over-dramatic hyperbole reactions to everything someone says or does like man actually got offended i went <laughs> when he saw the caption let's go what oh, with the caption let's go and it's for a boxer man what just fuck you what what do you mean why would you do that you're calling someone out on the dumbest thing you can anyone can say anything to you and you'll be like that so what are you drinking there mate Oh, this? This is just tea. No, 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 that can't be. You good, bro? That can't be. Like, if it was coffee, then fine. You know, I'm, I'm getting the chills. It's not coffee. It's not Sprite. I, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm done. That's just a little example of pretty much what it is. Like, anything someone would say, you'd have his overdramatic expressions. And So, for example, Shane was sat down with that psychiatrist or therapist or whoever that specimen was. Whoever that godly creature was. Apparently, I heard she was like a Dragon Ball Z character. I'm just, I'm just going on from a tangent, and that's just like basically all my videos. I just say random shit. But yeah, but whenever she would say something, then Shane would just have these reactions. They're, they're just, there's no need. It's just a conversation. In real life, if there was no cameras there, and this is sociopathic, I guess, if there's no cameras there, you wouldn't be doing that. Everyone on YouTube is over dramatic because you don't want to make it boring. Because, like, obviously, could you imagine someone intro a video like this? Uh, what is that? I also feel like the stock images they're using is so inappropriate and random. Like he'll say something about an action that Jake Paul has done. Like he'll he'll call someone he'll just call someone a bad name or someone, and then he'll put a picture of some guy like fucking hitting someone or killing someone. Like what they want. 
There's a bit of a difference between a murderer and someone that just does stupid shit. A lot of it is just the main thing that people talk I mean, I understand why he's doing it. For entertainment, one, and all the dramatic effects, and it's, it's well produced. I've got to give it that. Like, I'm watching all of them, so who's the dumb one here? And the second point, because he knows it's going to get views because it's about Jake Paul. Anything controversial towards Jake Paul is going to get views. For example, he's not going to make a video yet on fucking Ollie White or someone. Like, just someone, someone irrelevant, as you say. Irrelevant! Comment down below, yeah, if I should do a series, yeah, where I just go to loads of different places in the UK and try to find out where is the best tea to drink. I'll basically be the tea connoisseur. Do you know when, like, people drink something and they make random noises afterwards? Like, someone will literally do this. Or some, like, <laughs> I don't, okay, maybe not that. That's just some tribal language, but anyway, they'll, they'll do something weird, like... <sighs> Like literally, like why do you do that? Your breath and oxygen is taking up my personal space. I feel like obviously it's not like a normal video where he's just put a camera somewhere. It's high production video. He's hired people to talk, like specialists to talk with him. He's got a good camera crew. Like everything that he's doing, the stock footage is he's planned this well. He knows where he wants to go. I also have a hint of is it fake? That's what we want to know. Is it fake? Is Shane Dawson series fake? And is Jake Paul in on this? Most likely. I'm sorry to break it to you. Probably yeah. Because even though Jake Paul knows what it's like state, he has to first of all he'll get res he'll get some respect, even though he's gonna get a lot of hate for at least admitting to stuff he's done. And second of all, he's gonna get views and he's gonna get more relevant. Because let's be honest, other before the fight, Jake Paul like his views were going so down, he would barely get like a million views in one day, which is I mean it's a lot. But I'm saying for someone like him, he should be getting that like easily. I'm so I'm sorry, I just do random shit. Also, everyone loves a bit of beef or drama on YouTube, so no matter what is a, what the subject matter is about, it's going to get views, and they both know that, and I think they're both in on it for the paycheck. I actually think, I, I'm going to predict this now, I think drama or someone, maybe even me, if someone's going to reveal anyway that Jake Paul's going to get a percentage, maybe like, I don't know, 50%, 50 maybe 40% of the money that J uh, Shane Dawson's getting. Well, that's the end of my cup. So that's the end of the video. That's how it works nowadays. I guess that's a thing. I don't know. If you did like this video, please leave a like, subscribe, comment down below all your thoughts on this video and whether you think Shane Dawson is a manipulator and if you think Jake Paul is a sociopath. I'll speak to you guys in a bit. Cheers!